Hey folks, G Hondo here, and welcome back to Surviving Mars. This is episode four. In the last episode, I covered all the prefabs and went kind of nuts on them. And part of that was some prefabs I bought from Earth, including this lovely factory, which we absolutely will want. But at 50 power, we do not want it right now. So we're going to shut that off, and all of a sudden, our power situation will be so much better. We are still not doing great on water, but we did find water here. We just need to get... Here. Yeah, it's coming that way. We just need to get this guy going. So I'm dragging the commander up here. We have a drone hub as well. That'll help build all this stuff once this is in place. Let's uh, speed things up here just a bit. One thing I do wish this thing would show me is when I have the commander listed... Oops, too far. Uh, if it would be nice enough to show me... Oh, it does when he stops. Okay, it just doesn't show up while he's driving. Okay, I was going to say, I, I need the range so I know how far they can get. Uh, we do also have this prefab dome, so we're going to build that. It does have some moisture vaporizers in that, which will help, but it doesn't seem to have power. So I'm not entirely sure that that's going to help. I don't know if we have enough power here to govern all this, or if I'm going to have to plunk in some more infrastructure, but we shall wait and see. Let them build all that. Let's speed up even more. As a reminder, we are researching a whole bunch of stuff, specifically the water reclamation. It's a very expensive building, but hopefully it's worthwhile. Yes, I know you're not connected, and that's quite deliberate, to be honest. Yeah, that. Okay, so you are actually still drawing your power. Are you? Uh, partially, you're complaining you have not insufficient power, so... Alright, well clearly we are definitely going to need more power. There's just no question about this, so let's just do that. Uh, we do not have any more prefab sterlings, so I guess we'll be going wind. Again, I don't think it makes a humongous difference where these things go. Maybe I'll just start line of them here. I don't know if that's enough, but we'll go with that. Alright, let's go with that. Because you're not busy enough yet. <laughs> Actually, can we even reach that? The other, where's the other hub? There was another hub here, right? Yeah, that's fine. It can handle that. Okay, you are not working... Oh, storage space is full. That's fine, we can fix that. That's easy. Depot for concrete. In fact, why don't, why don't we have a couple of them, actually? I don't ever want them to stop, so let's just build a couple of them. Oh, we found more water. Or is that the same water? It's just kind of... Oh no, that's definitely a different water because we were up here. Okay, good. So we actually are good for water in this area then. And a new anomaly. Where's our buddy here? Are you busy? No? Good. Get out here. <laughs> you weren't busy before? You are now. hooked up now that we have some power. Not good amounts of power, but some. Why is this not being built? Are we out of metals? Mm, kind of. Okay, we need to find more metals. There's lots of underground. Do we have any surface metals? There's apparently some here somewhere. Right there, it looks like. Excellent. Okay, Mr. Transport Man. If you would be so kind, please, as to pick up... Again, also say all, but let's face it, it's... It's not actually all, it's just metals. And one of you is... This will just plunk it there, I guess. That'll do. Yeah, because that's a metals depot. So we actually do have some, it's just... They aren't dragging it over here. 
Maybe I need more. Probably wouldn't be a bad idea to have a couple of these floating around here and there. Just to aid with any building constructions. Right, let's try that. Okay. Still don't officially have life support. Because this cable still has not been built. In fact, none of this stuff here has been built yet, but that's fine. Metals are slowly making their way out here, and then they are being transferred, so it's good I don't have to explicitly do that. I was concerned about that in an earlier episode, because it had looked like I had to explicitly haul materials around. And that would have been very, very annoying, frankly. Anomaly analyzed. There's more to the barren environs of the Red Planet than meets the eye. A veritable treasure trove of undiscovered knowledge and wonder. So long as you know where to look. Okay, so basically... Alright, so it didn't actually give us the research, it just, it's letting us research it early. That's still kind of neat. Again, these are definitely things we will want, but I don't know that I'm going to call them terribly urgent. I guess drones moving faster would be very convenient, but it's really not a super big deal. Interesting, this one's got a huge cost reduction. Neat. Okay, well, either way, that is stuff we will get to. Even more water. Very nice. Okay, so water is maybe not as bad as I was originally thinking. I guess just that, because I happen to be scanning south first. But whereas all the water tended to be north, as it turned out. So maybe that was just a bad luck thing. I'm not sure. Can we get this going here, guys, please? There's so much here. All you need is metals. Metals should be happening. Right? If metal has already happened, and you're already out. Okay, uh, more metals then, please. Now let's say... We may have to prioritize getting the underground metals going much sooner than I originally was thinking. When do we get access to that? That's probably engineering, probably. And we can't even see it. Okay, I guess we will not know then. We're just going to have to wait. We'll have to just keep scanning around until we happen to find stuff. So, the subject of scanning, let's just grab a bunch more. I guess that's all we can queue. Okay, we'll just do that. That's fine. Can they fly by metal extractor? Now, before I thought it said I didn't even know the tech for that. Have I since picked up the tech and I've forgotten? That is possible. Oh, yeah. Okay, so that must have been a research we already did then, and I just completely whiffed on it. Okay. Well, that's... Oh, wait, no, it's rare metals. I just need normal metals. Right. Well, I mean, I will need those eventually as well, but for now, it's just general metals we need. Okay, but it's going to take a lot of workers. That's not really ideal, but I don't think we get a vote. All right, where is the nearest... Probably right there, right? Oh, I would say thank you so much. Now that's concrete. Is that really the closest one? It might very well be. There's another one over there. Actually, if anything, I'd say probably these ones are closer. Yeah, let's just do these ones. Okay. Metal extractor. No, it's too far from a dome. It does have to be much closer to a dome. Ah, that's going to be a problem. That's going to be a problem. And yes, I saw this. Let's slow things down so this doesn't get too far ahead of me. So we definitely don't have any that happen to be near a dome. That's a big problem. Okay, well, I didn't know that, so that's entirely my fault. So I will take the L on that one. Still aren't done. Get on it. Anyway, alright, so we have water reclamation, wherever that was from. 
was there. Yep, biotech. And now we will be able to have better vaporators, but that's still, even 50% is not that good, because frankly, they only do one anyway. So from, going from 1 to 1 1.5 isn't really doing much. But I suppose it would be something to get at some point. Now, you're still hanging in there, that's fine. Okay, what shall we do then? Let's have a look at that water spire building. What's that? It's probably under life support, right? I would guess. No, definitely not seeing it. So the dome shouldn't be that hard to find, right? Oh, dome spire. Okay, here we go. Okay, so let's go in a dome. Oh, okay, so it is the main thing. Does that mean there's going to be other things and I kind of have to just pick one? Possibly. I think for now, though, we will definitely get it. And if we ever have to rip it down and put something better up, well, then we'll deal with it then. But... Okay. Ooh, somebody wants some attention. Yeah, I know we need metals badly. We are still looking for metals. I'm saying that there is some surface metals around here somewhere. Where are they? Oh, there they are. Okay. Maybe you can just bring that back to here, I guess. Sector scan. Another new anomaly. Thank you very much. We like those. Explore, please. Thank you so much. Awesome. Okay. Speed things up some more. It also gives us a very tiny amount of more metals there. So when this guy is done, you can do that. Not much there, but we'll take it. Oh, okay, interesting. So I guess that's an option, right? I just build a basically a wee tiny tiny dome just to pick up some metals. So that's an option. This will go down in history. Oh, okay, we have survived the ten. Cool. So now we can get more people. Neat. Very, very neat. Seriously, it's one metal. You should be able to handle this. Anomaly found. Our initial spectrographic analysis confirmed Chromium. It. Chromium. To find such a rich deposit of such a rare metal. Important was an understatement. Okay, well, as far as I know, we still have a few of these kicking around. I mean, we may have wanted this, but I think I am just going to take an engineering tech reduction. That sounds really good. And a bomb. Oh, I don't think I'm liking where this is going. So, you're going to offer me money to do something that I'm almost certainly not going to like. So, do I just ignore it, or do I try to take them down? That's a good question. I'm definitely not taking it. Not, uh, <laughs> not interested. Maybe we'll try and be like super good boys, right? Yeah, that's fine. We are not getting involved in that, thanks. That just does not sound like a good idea. But when you're done, you sure are. As soon as this is back, it is done. Go and grab that other one. Oh, there was too much. Oh, there's too much for that. That's neat that it'll just put it there as a temporary storage for you. That's actually quite convenient. Anyway, uh, where was the. Oh, there's a good pile right there. Let's just go grab that. 
should check if there's a hot key, like a keyboard shortcut for that. Because that's a button you press a lot, so I'm kind of expecting there to be one. Let's just plug them there, that's fine. Okay. Well, and our spire here is done. Very nice. So the water situation should be better, but it's still not great. But it's definitely better. At least I'm assuming it's better. Because this is definitely using water. And I'm sure generally they just use water, so I'm hoping that's actually helping. And I didn't just completely waste <laughs> waste all the time doing that. Okay, so you are fueled up. Well, you still have some food from before. We didn't even take all of it off. Wow. That means I don't have enough storage for food. Do you store it there, or is that just a general... No, you just store those in Universal Depot, so why... Which I have several of. They're not all full, are they? Maybe they are. Research complete. Okay, so here's what we're going to do. Let us grab a couple more just Universal Depots, and let's put them out here. Just a whole bunch of them. With some gap between so the drones can get between them. Now, adapted probes, that was the one that lets me scan, right? Yeah, so now I should be doing the probe scanning. Which was X, right? Yes. So let us go ahead and Sector scan. do that. Perfect. Do I have any more probes? Where do I see how many probes I have? Oh, down here. Okay. Anomaly found. Okay. Good. And another new anomaly. Very, very good. Your idol. Off you go. Thank you. still being unloaded but they are at least unloading now so that's good and we can send this rocket back and bring in some more people and probably some more stuff which one i should do first more people or more stuff probably more people why are you showing not yeah okay i need more people for sure which means I'm going to need more housing for sure. So let's do that. Uh, where was living complex? Will that fit here? No, not a chance. Yeah, that takes up the entire entire block. That's fine. You are ready to go. Perfect. Yes, you can go. Thank you for your service. How are you doing? You are almost refueled, and you are also completely clean. So, anomaly found. you will be ready to go. We have more anomalies. Yep. Excellent. wait for this one to finish. We're just about out of time for today, but I'd like to let this finish. And then send it towards the other one just so it's on the way when I... Discovered. You just gave me something. Where was it? Here it is. Oh. Now I wonder if that will count the one I just launched or whether that one still goes at the old speed. It probably still goes at the old speed, but still, simply... Oh, I don't, it didn't, sorry, it didn't give it to me, it just gave me the option. I still have to research it, so it won't count anyway. But still, that's neat. I don't know, I'm going to call that relevant, because I'm not, never usually in a screaming hurry for anything, but still, that is a nice to have, and we might as well queue up some more things. So, what shall we get? Okay, that one sounds good. I don't think I want that right now. The last thing I want is to be drawing more power. Simply 
do better at your jobs. Okay, that works. And where was that other anomaly? I'm quite sure you told me there was another anomaly. Where was it? I don't remember now. I'm quite sure it said there was two of them. Quite sure, in fact. No, well, that's just metals. Where the heck was it? <laughs> oh, way over here. Okay, well, you've got a, quite the drive in front of you, bud. But off you go. Glorious. And... Oh, I see. So I didn't... I probably didn't actually even need to build the second one, except I guess that made it faster. So much like the water, it's just the square it's on that actually matters. Okay. Good to know. So let's go ahead and get the replacement queued up. Uh, that's a production concrete extractor. I wonder why it shows facing. Maybe I did need the, uh, that one after all. I don't know. Either way, let's get that going there. Get it cabled in. Now this is going to be gone, so I have to, should go straight to the cable. All right, fine. Be ugly then. <laughs> this is almost full anyway, so we might as well put in a new one of those while we're at it. So we want a large dumping site. You can go right about over here somewhere sure and a depot specifically for concrete there and there perfect okay so they'll have to let that all go we're gonna need the commander to come and do that but frankly I'd rather have the commander over here first at least to build this hub after that the hub can take care of the rest of that so let's just move this guy forward couple of squares and that should sort that out. Right. Just want to make sure you are in range. You sure are. Yeah, we're gonna run over time a little bit here, but I want to get this at least started. So now once this is in range, you should now be allowed to come down here. And these can be scrapped. Salvage, I guess is the term it uses. Either way, they can go. I guess technically so can this bit of cable, but I don't know how relevant that is. Research complete. Advanced Martian engines. Which one was that? This one. Ah, right. Simply less fuel. Ah, good, so we're just going to pull some of that fuel back out. That's very nice. How convenient. Okay, very good. So yeah, we are definitely out of time for today, but I think we've done some good work. We scanned several anomalies. The water situation is now finally looking good. Power is looking okay. I'd like it to be a little better, but... Although it's even holding, because it's nighttime now, because these have closed up. So I think we're okay power-wise even at night, so that's a very good sign. Got a new concrete started. It's not done, but it's started. This new dome is ready to go whenever we want to put stuff in it. And this water will be done shortly, and then we'll definitely be good for water. So yeah, that's very, very good. The rocket here is back, which means I can grab new passengers. So I think that's something I'm gonna do off camera. So what I think I'll do is I'll sort that out off camera and next episode I will simply start with showing what I've done. So I think we'll call it there for today. So thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. 
And if you did, please leave a like and a comment. And if you haven't already, please do subscribe. It really does help. Other than that, we'll catch you in the next episode. Have a good one. See ya.